There's more of the big trees. Very beautiful. My name is Arthur Jilks, but people always call me Joe, so I am Joe Jilks. And I am Beth Jilks, I'm his wife. Uh, and um, we've lived most of our lives in Australia. We do enjoy travelling and we enjoy every opportunity to hike in different countries, wherever we can. And this is the first time we've had a hiking holiday in Taiwan. Uh, we've been doing this all our married life. We have been married for 52 years. And this is what our family does for enjoyment and have our holidays. When our children were small, we used to take them hiking and camping. And it's lovely to have two of our children with us on this little holiday too. This time we have two sons with us, their wives, and one of them has brought their daughter. So we have three generations walking up the mountain today. So you see, they put up that sign four years ago saying that the tree was 1,400 years old. So I know it must be 1,404 yeah. years old. Yeah. <laughs> so 17k from here. So six and a half hours to get us to the end of the trail today. Okay, let's go. Need a help? I wanted uh, to use this trip to help promote tourism in Taiwan because it's such a beautiful place and I'd like to encourage more people to come here. There's a second message that I'd like to give and that message is to people like my wife, myself, people who were born in the first half of the last century <laughs> which means that uh, <laughs> getting <old. laughs> we're getting a little bit old. But if you keep yourself fit, if you eat well, do regular exercise, you can keep on doing things such as this. So um, we might be work walking a bit slower than what we used to, but we're still able to walk and we really enjoy getting out in the bush and we really hope that we'll be able to keep walking for many years to come. A toad uh, pretending uh, to be a rock. I think if I stay still, no one will notice me. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, a toad. Not a clean toad. You don't like clean toads. Yeah. I don't think anybody likes clean toads, do they? It's from We've done 13 kilometres already, mm -hmm. with another five to go. Some of the track's been a bit rocky, so you had to be careful. Uh, also, the fact that we've had recent rain made some of the rocks slippery uh, and uh, we've had to be very careful about uh, it. Has, uh, it's been an excellent walk and I'm thinking this must be one of the best walks in the world, you know. How do you feel about Taiwan? How do, you... How do I oh, feel about it? It's, like it. it's just <laughs> wonderful. <laughs> it's just wonderful. The outside world thinks of Taiwan as a place that manufactures clothing because in Australia you get a lot of um, Taiwanese clothing. So they think of Taiwan as a place where you have a manufacturing base and whether it be clothing or whether it be electrical goods and they haven't got any idea that you've got this beautiful range of mountains running down the length and breadth of the island with so much beauty, natural beauty, as well as the history with the Aborigines who live up there, that's another aspect. But they don't understand how incredibly beautiful this island is. And if they just get out of the cities and come up into the mountains, they would find out for themselves just how beautiful it is. 
So yes, we will encourage our friends to come and enjoy the beauty of this island. It's good, it's good, good. in the summertime. Big smile. Mm. Yeah. A new shirt with the Taiwan flag. And I see Taiwan as a wonderful example of a country which is modern and yet still has a lot of uh, tradition. And I find that a very exciting combination. Wonderful walk. Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful scenery. It's a lovely place to be. I like the mountains and the cloud. It's a pity that we were unable to get to Jade Mountain, but this is very, very beautiful. We'll have to come back to Taiwan another time to climb Jade Mountain. Here. So we're looking at one kilometre, one kilometre It was a very good walk. The rain made it more interesting and challenging. Some of the rocks were slippery, but uh, nothing serious happened. We had no accidents. So an excellent walk and really surprised to find that there's nobody else out here enjoying it with us. It's the sort of walk that every person should try to do at some stage. He uh, dreams up the big dreams and I make them happen. But uh, we're a good team, and because we're a good team, we get great adventures together. In a few words, it's been a very exciting adventure, and we look for more tomorrow, and when we return in a few years' time, we'll keep on coming back to Taiwan, I'm sure. <laughs>